What's up, guys? Welcome back to another installment of Tunis Tips, a series where we cover the upcoming bosses in Pokemon Go and go over the best raid counters to use and bring into those battles, give you the highest chance of success. Maybe we'll see you on that end raid achievement screen at the end of each raid. We've got Tapu Fini coming in to Pokemon Go, the release of Tapu Fini. Let's head on over to Poke Battler and see some of those counters that we might be bringing now tapu finny is a fairy and water type that means it's going to be weak to poison grass and electric so if you look over here we've got pokey battler pulled up to show us the best counters to use looks like our favorite up there is mega gengar could we like seeing that other mega choices to bring could be venusaur b drill maybe even manectric lots of different mega options for you guys some electric stuff that you could bring would be Zekrom, Electfire, Shadow Electfire, Shadow Raikou, even Magnezone Shadow. So Rude being the first non-Shadow, non-Mega, uh, you know, other one of those legendaries. So Zerude up there as well. More, more Shadows, more electric types, Venusaur, Tangrowth, Ampharos, Roserade. There was a community day for Roserade. Latios is kind of interesting, but it does get solar beam. So maybe maybe those solar beam mega Latios if you want to bring all the way down to the 17th, but it's better than a backflip in Lugia, right? Tapu Bulu up there as well, as long as some non-shadow choices, even Celebi making an appearance on that list. And your uh, Shadow Ho-Oh, who even gets solar beam as well. Checking these counters, I think I'll be bringing a team consisting of mainly Gengar, and since it's like my favorite Pokemon. So uh, let's head over and check out what uh, check out what we should do for a team here. So if you're not sure, or if you've never made a team before, you can click on the Pokemon ball at the bottom there, the Pokeball at the bottom. Click on your battle team here, go up to party, scroll all the way down and go to create a new team which is right here let's call this one finny tapu finny let's go ahead and make that let's go like this that should add me a team then we can go here and start selecting our counters now if we remember correctly we did see gengar on there so let's bring a gengar let's bring some other gengars too um i don't have any others that are powered up to 40. the one that i'm going to be leading with will be my mega so i will have a mega gengar with lick and sludge bomb those next two gengar are going to feature lick and sludge bomb my third slot i'm going to bring a zarude i did manage to power up my zarude to level 40. he wanted to be bringing the moves vine whip and power whip also, I have a Shundo Roserade that I would like to use in the battle here. So I'll bring Roserade. Now it's got the Community Day Bullet Seed. And so I know that the uh, battler suggests Poison Jab. If you don't have access to Bullet Seed, just bring Poison Jab and Grass Knot on that. And the sixth slot, I'm just going to bring a Venusaur with uh, Frenzy Plant and Vine Whip. There we go. That'll be the team of available counters that I have to bring. Maybe yours were different. Maybe uh, tell me what teams you plan on bringing down in the comments below there. But as always, we like to keep these short and sweet, concise. You guys, thanks for coming in and checking out that new boss, Tapu Fini. If you're interested in raiding that boss coming up here for the next couple weeks you can find me over at twitch tv forward slash legend tuna i'm live every day 4 p.m to 9 p.m pacific hosting raids playing stream raiders and also playing a little bit of uh, pokemon community game hope to see you guys out there in the raid lobbies and we'll see you next time peace